Human history and evolution chart their own way. We individuals are mere instruments in their paths, striving to do what we think is best for a greater good. In the history of international law enforcement, this day marks a milestone. It resonates with the collective dedication of global police cooperation in making ours a safer world. In 2008, the world witnessed Formula One cars zipping through the streets of Singapore at night. It was the first time an F1 Grand Prix race was held under the night sky. A year later, were born our very first thoughts. Could this city-state be the place Interpol was looking for? Could it house a new global complex for innovation to complement our headquarters in France to help us better fight 21st century crime? Eventually, the answer was given by Interpol's member countries at our General Assembly in 2010. It was a resounding and unanimous yes. And it paved the way for establishing what was felt critically essential for the growing needs of law enforcement worldwide. Police are traditionally trained to protect citizens from harm, a harm that is visible or simply physical in nature. But the widening intersection of real and virtual lives challenges that very tradition. And hence, with the Interpol Global Complex for Innovation, Interpol wanted to establish a center dedicated to fighting cybercrime. Exactly a hundred years ago, it was a city-state, Monaco, that hosted the first International Criminal Police Congress. History was created then, and history is being created right here, right now, and yet again, in another city-state, Singapore. Our vision of a safer world cannot be realized overnight. It is to be reached bit by bit, milestone after milestone. In a constantly evolving world, this vision cannot be realized without what we believe is also in Interpol's DNA. Let history remember the Interpol Global Complex for Innovation as testimony to Interpol's ability to adapt to change while protecting citizens worldwide from crime even as crime itself continues to evolve and remain invisible to us all, now and forever.